Hi, Paul Messenger here with another update to the public demo site, also known as the cloud demo system. So one thing I've always been asked to be able to do over the years is demo a fisheye in a 360 and how we can de-warp it in the Milestone Smart Client. Back in the day, I had a clip running with the Century 360 universal um, de-warper. But what we've installed is a real uh, Bosch fisheye camera in the lobby at the Lake Oswego headquarters in Oregon. And we've installed the, um, I've installed the Bosch de-warping plugin here, which you can get from the sales download repository. But the first thing you'll notice when you log into the smart client is there's now a Bosch de-warping view. This left tile won't work until you have the uh, plugin installed. But once you do, you have the ability to take the, the raw image, which is on the right, uh, the standard fisheye, and show off to partners and then customers how uh, partners like Bosch that have written a de-warping plugin allow you to manipulate the image. So then I can drag around on the left-hand side. I can drag the move. If I use my scroll wheel, I can zoom in and zoom out uh, to execute the, the de-warp of the uh, camera. Pretty standard functionality. But again, seeing is believing it helps when you can actually show this off, especially with a real camera uh, to your customers. And then in the upper right, you'll see you've got the ability to trigger this dropdown. And that's where you can choose uh, the different views that the Bosch Dewarping plugin gives you. You can do the quad and show how you can digitally uh, adjust each, um, each zone to give you a more complete view of what's happening in this camera. So I can draw all the different areas and just have a quick, easy dewarp snapshot of sort of the four regions of coverage that the, uh, the camera covers. We've got some privacy masking here to protect the people at the reception desk and the conference rooms, just in case any of your people watching uh, ask. But that's um, really it. And then you see you've got the other options to do the full uh, you know, 360 panorama, which is nice. And as you spin, it's giving you the, the intelligence uh, exactly telling you where you are with a particular um, uh, field of view. But once you play around with it, it's pretty straightforward. Um, you go to the full 360 and then the, the popular you know, double panorama where I can bring it to that side and then I can wheel this to the other side. It gives me a nice clean snapshot of everything that's happening versus using the, uh, the standard raw image. And then fully supported in playback as well. So if I go to playback and I jump to a time when I had a recording, you'll see that I can play the video back. And over there, I can see an individual that appears. So uh, dewarp in both the live and the playback views is compatible. I can jump to um, uh, you know another clip and scene and, and just show that that's supported. So pretty uh, basic functionality, but uh, it's nice to show uh, that we have the, this ability. Again, we can do this really well with Bosch, with Axis, the ones that have plugins. And pretty soon, we'll release some, uh, hopefully pretty soon, we'll re release some native dewarping to uh, remove the ability to have to use plugins. But in the short term, you can demo what it looks like and, and uh, show end customers and partners that dewarping is definitely possible with select camera partners in the Miles and Smart client. So um, yeah, send me feedback, use cases, stories you can uh, to myself or the team. And uh, thanks, everyone. Take care.